Hey guys, Serge here with the December 30th, 1941 combat replay from a 1v1 against Invictus on War in the Pacific, Admiral's Edition on Scenario 2. Let's see what happens. Not expecting... Not expecting anything. Just kind of doing status quo turn. Oh, god damn it. He, his stub is still sitting in Numea. Oh. So this is what was that pattern then? Two AMCs? Yeah, destroy mine layers. They don't have any torpedoes, unfortunately. Go right back into the fight. Uh, he sets two of my boats on fire. I hit the Hokokumaru three times. I'm doing it again. Looks like it turned into heavy fires. Fun. One hit equals heavy fires. Hit the Hokoku four more times. Well, at least I know that wasn't a landing force. Oh, come on, dude. Go away. I, mean, I have ASW ships en route. I just didn't think he'd just still be sitting in the damn port. And he's going after an AKL in the Java Sea. Uh, that's fine. I don't care about these AKLs. He gets a second one. Oh, I thought I moved the... I guess I missed the submarine order. Hopefully don't lose it. Take two hits with the tarpon. Oh, no. Okay, he loses it. Doesn't find it. ASW attack at Pago. Uh, two hits on the I-24. Under the air AM phase. Bombing in China starts, and in the Philippines, loses the lily to a flak. Bombing mole mine, takes a few damaged sallies. Bombing Singapore, loses two, potentially two more sallies, with potentially 16 more taking damage. Singapore's flak is just deadly. Nate, is he straight? He's strafing. Interesting. More sallies. And another one gets shot down by Flack. It's the end of the air AM phase, under the air PM phase. Spotting ships. And what sea is that called? South China Sea, there we go. Oh, he's actually got escorts this time. Thankfully, he does not hit any of the AKs. I'll probably stop the uh, evac of goods with my bigger AKs. And I'll just send them to... Send them somewhere else. Another ASW attack. At Pago, nothing happens. 
unfortunately. So, uh, quiet... Oh, sorry, land phase, obviously. Deliberate attack on the rail line. Can he kill it? No, of course not. He's gonna make him still live. I want these guys to die so they'll respawn. Deliberate attack between Piping and Calgon. Another retreat, unfortunately. Yes! Got you, bitch! The rest of the, these units walked in. He's gonna lose his entire. Yeah, down to six. His entire unit just got disabled. 1,500 casualties. 192 squads disabled. 10 engines disabled. The fact he doesn't have a single destroyed squad is bullshit. How does it not? How does he not lose that unit? I take two destroyed squads. He takes Lo Yang. He bombards at Clark. Still no AV reinforcements. Still just the same stuff he's had. Uh, he loses one squad. I take two disabled. He takes Pak Hoi. So I'll stop taking that drain of victory point. I bombard back. At Clark. And it's a really fucking good one. I only inflict 17 casualties. But I destroy a gun. Destroy 7 vehicles. Disable 2 more guns and 14 more vehicles. With nothing in return. Please die. Please tell me these guys died. No. Oh, come on, dude. Please... Please die. Ooh, he pair dropped Port Blair. Good job, Invictus. Overall, good turn. Had that uh, huge engagement in China. Unfortunate about. The AK at Numea. This was thing just gonna disband those AKs again. Okay, I still need to get I got a Kai Nai Kang. And I'm getting someone to Hydera Batsend as well. Get a base force and a tank regiment. What up the blank turn? He loses six planes to my one, four of which were to flak. He also loses a Sonia Atina. Uh, Tina was at Port Blair. I also lose a one three nine. Interesting. Ops reports. I need to take check damage. Field, field artillery have a heading to Kuching. You're heading down to Tahiti. These guys will be loading up soon. Ah, these damn it, these guys need another day. Uh, escorts came in, so I'll be able to split these guys up if I need to, and just have more ASW capabilities up here. Uh, down here, I need to divert these guys south. Maybe, no, nah, I don't think so. 
but let's look here. Uh, one hit, and it's done a cons considerable amount of damage. I uh, definitely want to get it disbanded just so it can work on the fires, and then it can work on systems and such. Oh, that's right. I need, actually need to turn the AO around so I can refuel these guys. That's unfortunate. There's like a... You know, those two icons are like on top of each other, overlaid. Yeah. Disband the Iron Crown again. These guys are... Two days away, turn these guys around, or I can let them go in and and I can also just let them go in and disband so I stop wasting time there. You guys have unloaded 16,000 supply at Port Moresby, which is just huge. Um, yeah, these. I got some good AK, some better AKs in here. And they're at their limit for fuel anyway, so those guys will be heading to Perth. Gonna try and sneak a little bit of supply into Batan. And then I'm just gonna probably try and sneak some, probably put some more supply on there as well. It's got subs patrolling the straits between Batavia and Oosthaven. He's got his battleship force moving east, back to the home islands most likely. Moving his infantry regiment back into Davao. Need to remember to set these guys to... I'm going to do shock attack. I'm going to do shock attack. I want to destroy that unit. Uh, still hasn't gotten everyone in here yet. I must be really doing really bad on my hex math because I thought he'd have been there by now. Uh, I can form up the Indian Brigade, Indian not Indian Brigade, Indian Division. That is two hundred and eighty-eight assault value. Bring that right up to Mall Mine. Provide some much-needed firepower. That's not doing it. Uh, the guys at Aiden, part of 7th Armored Brigade, which I can form in five days. And it's already bought out because it it's going to be bought out because I have to uh, transport it by sea. Because it spawned the, on the off-map base. Those will always come up. Those will always spawn as a, a free non-restricted unit. Damn near full TOE tanks is going to be huge. Uh, got some aircraft coming in in a few days. Got more ships arriving at Cape Town. And those units arrived at uh, Geraldton. Okay, I did do that. I just had to make sure I did that. And we're doing really good. Uh, check the weather. Gonna be nice and rainy. Rainy and thunderstorms. Anti-air at Singapore is going nutso. Just how I want it to. He may even run over some of my subs with that. It'd be nice if I can get hit into his battleships. I'm railing a unit into here. 
I mean, I started railing it from like as far away as I possibly could have too, though. It was part of the problem. Started railing them from Madras, basically. I'm pretty sure it's Madras. And where is the? It's got to be close at this point. I'm not seeing it. Did I forget to? What? No, uh, it was a Madras, it was like Madras Police Battalion or something. That's who I'm moving. Did I actually send it to Calcutta? No, but I might as well send this up there since I don't can't obviously can't find it. Can't find the unit that I was thought I was sending up there. Well, the unit just like disappeared. Oh wait, there it is. How is it only there? Okay, it's gonna be a few more days, I guess. Alright, I'm gonna end the episode here, so I will see you guys in the next one.